Good afternoon, Mzansi. It is half past two on a Thursday, right here on SAPC One. Mzansi for sure. Long to touch about the Asia Lemnandi me. Ikamalam guzola nambona, and I am your health and fitness buddy. Now, are you going into that can crush someone's confidence in a split second? Jenge body odor. Whether you said Jimmy or you just had a long day, M seven zin. Now, I'm trying to stop. It's not calling out your body odor and finding ways to beat it. Let's go. Nandi me. Can you join in? Get past the chat. Get the buzz. Look at the movie. And in the la umdu, I know improve. In the la, I know kanga yo. Kovu isa wena ne family yako. Goza ma imil enja abano itan. Sepi nge sepambe ikazi for health. When we pass some exercise moves, kona apa itchimi. Imzansi yona ingabi full shanga tiba nuka kamande makasha onge. Nani me? Bad body odor can actually kill your confidence. What a long I tell you about self esteem, Yako Mayife. Now we met up with someone who has intimate knowledge of this. Check it out. Nani me. Kaludumelisa, Mulinan, Lena, Munandi me, like Ali Viso Kitolo Felomotani, and this is where I practice at Dance Moon Studios. I started dancing a very long time ago. I introduced the more fatting little dancing. Um, I was a bit of a naughty boy, um, but what happened, I ended up injuring my knee playing basketball. And um, while recovering, I got introduced into dancing by my grandmother. Um, and then from then on, the love for dancing just grew. I was a little bit of a naughty boy, but I was a little bit of to look fresh and to always keep the sweat of your skin, so to speak. In um, when we're practicing, we always have some kind of deodorant or colognes with us. And we towel, because we sweat a lot. Every time I see my clients, I always advise them to, to, to have with them as obviously a bottle of water and a sweat towel. Khanzare dancer, there's no way of hiding the sweat from, from, from your skin. So you will be in contact with that. But then, all, like I've, I've mentioned before, always creating a sweat towel and taking those um, five to ten minute breaks in between so that um, just to cool down a little bit. But to prevent that sweat and in that contact, there's no way you can actually prevent it. All we try and do is just keep it at a minimum. Um, always apply your deodorant or cologne, perfume for ladies, um, and a sweat towel every time. I would say that in the sport that we're in, because of the amount of time you're in contact with your partner or partners, um, you learn to adjust. And you need to adjust to the next person's sweat, but at the same time, respecting that person, respecting each other, um, at some point you need to just wipe yourself down. As a, as a dancer, it's, it's very important that you eat healthy, look after yourself, um, drink lots and lots of water. And, Make sure that whatever that you, because obviously whatever that you intake and in, take into your body, you will sweat it out. So always get enough sleep if you can, eat healthy, drink lots and lots of water. Nani me. I get so frustrated and bilangayo, but that doesn't always mean it's a bad thing. Let's try and understand this better with this clip. Nani me. Umziba una sweat lenses in easy. A sweat lens in Nanana with skin and the producer Umbilo. Classic Jima, a sweat lens, the release of Umbilo onto his kumba in order for Ba Umzimba Ukwazu Kulisha down. Omnia Umbilo O Pumayo Akana Vumba Matasha Onge, Kotake Unayo e bacteria, a seven zayo to break down his sweat kakona, which makes it Uba Ibene Vumba. Iakwazu Bambelela Quinwele Zetu Kunyan Umzimba Wetu, giving la bacteria more to hold on to. Londo ke yenza ivumba lipine lichale elo na kusha la kilali. Nani me? So uba no loa zingesa so uba bacteria is the sense ya mzibeni wako actually empowers you ukuba we change when you need to. So I'm changing with me in studio. I am with U Doctor Eddie who is an aesthetic specialist. Also sniga ke uluazo olubani zinge body odor. Doctor, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining us. Thanks. So Doctor, what causes body odor? 
It's actually a natural process. We, our body actually gives water off, not a smell, water off. Okay. And what happens then is that we have sometimes a smell and that smell actually only comes from two sections of your body, underneath your arms, mm -hmm. where we all sweat, or in your groin area. And that mixes with bacteria that's in those areas and that is where you get the odor from. So doctor, don't know Angela walk bill. It's actually your body, it's almost like a radiator of a car. Yeah. You cool down. Yeah. Um, your pores, your, your legs, your whole body sweat. Mm -hmm. And there's two different types of glands that you have yeah. underneath your feet, your hand, and the rest of your body. Yeah. There's actually between two and four million glands, sweat glands in your body. Yeah. And that sweat glands cools down your system. So Dr. Kutani, Abantu, or in Tennessee, Abantu, Sinuka, and Angela, as a Shukile. It's the bacteria that you've got. Yeah. It's almost like unique. the gene. Yeah. It is a, a unique thing. Some of us don't smell at all. Mm. And some of us, it's not like you picked up an illness or something. Mm. It is just that that's the way you smell. So doctor, singing is a good to improve the sound of the sound and the sound of the sound to prevent the sound of the sound. I think the biggest thing is hygiene. Yeah. Shower. Shower, wash on the places where the sun don't shine. <laughs> Big problem because a lot of people think the, the odor only comes from underneath the arm. It comes from the groin area as well. Yes. So yeah. especially if you work out. Okay, so doctor, I've heard about deodorant crystals, right? So if you was about the seven journey and are they effective? They are. I like the fact that it's natural. Okay. And these crystals absorb because they also salt mm -hmm. and they actually dry the area. Sometimes they're not that effective, okay. but it is a good investment. I like the fact that it's natural. Mm -hmm. The crystals work, yeah. they last long, mm -hmm. but invest in a crystal that, that is, I actually want to say, a better quality. Mm -hmm and always drink water because you have to cool your system down. Yes. You know, the sweaty palms and all of that, if, if you don't have water mm -hmm. to cover your sweat, yes. that becomes also a problem. Yeah. So, you know, you have to hydrate yourself to get all the toxins and the sweat oh, out of your system yes. so that your system is cooled down. Mm. Because why, do, when you get fever, you say cold sweat. Yes. But it's actually your system trying to cool you down. And that's why, you know, years ago you had your grandmother or you'll see on, on, a, on a movie that they put a little, you know, uh, wet you cloth on your yes. face, you know, um, to cool yourself cool. down. So we have all experienced a day where we feel a bit smelly and gross. So we took it to the streets to find out about Nina Niti Nina Lomba. Nani me. When you, I guess when you don't use roll-on, uh, and then you're doing sports, it's a hot day, that, yeah, then you're sweating, that causes a lot of body, body odor. I would say uh, strenuous activity and, and, and mal active is a danger, yeah. I don't think it's even about age. When you know who's see, you know, there's that thing, you know, and it's not about age actually, because the body odor oh, happens to anyone. I guess as soon as they start smelling a bit uh, funky, then you should give him some roll on. I would say when they reach a lesson, so when they start coming on maturity and stuff like that, they should uh, use roll on. So. So get a pick and ping, saying oksa spray nya, and I click something, cause I can't be comfortable walking around nya chuluga and get my body cut I go home. Yeah, I definitely go home. Well, if I'm far from home, then I'll uh, look for a public toilet and try to, you know, fix it a bit. Well, I, we we grew up being taught that hygiene is good, so you have to really. Take a bath, put on the roll-on, and always be your best, you know? Yes, they have, like, um, I think in primary. And then they, uh, they told us that it's maintainable if you use the right uh, 
was it uh, deodorant and stuff? I think um uh, and you know we'll see Okoko are very honest, so they will tell you we'll say as in man humble case humble case me. Ingama wena wenza njani na ukubulala ivumba elinga mnanda anga to use perfume or kanyi deodorant. Let us know on social media and we will see you after the break. Nani me. Nani me. Welcome back. So we're on a journey towards getting a better body smell. And fortunately for us in studio, I am chin chilling with the funniest doctor I've ever met. And he's here to give us tips on how we can fight your uncle and body odor. Are there any natural home remedies that one can use to prevent bad body odor or to just decrease excessive sweating? I know of a lot of people that have actually used tea tree oil. So you actually just put a little bit, it's got a nice smell, so you will smell clean and just damp it. Small things like hygiene of shaving your armpits. Yeah. Then there's bicarb, put that on, not a lot, it will just absorb it. Okay, so doctor, now this is a personal question, right? And I always do this. Now, is this a problem? It's normal. There's treatments for it, but it is not necessarily a problem. Yeah. Because people sweat the same type of glands that's in your hands are the same ones in your feet. Yes. So, just doing this like you've been doing the mm -hmm. whole day, <laughs> that helps. It yeah. is not necessarily a problem. So, Dr. Best, you have body odor, right? So, now, if you have a body odor, you have a body odor, you have a body odor, and you have a body odor. I think it's a very sensitive thing. Make yeah. sure that you are close with the person mm. because you maybe get slapped. Yeah. Um, I have been in situations where I would say, oh, it's hot out there. And you know, when it's so hot, I can smell myself. Yeah. But then you don't necessarily smell yourself. I would rather throw it out there and make it my problem to tell you that you've got a problem. I think you can get to that point where you say, you just buy the product and give it to them and say, they must try because you like the smell of it, especially yeah. if it's your boyfriend. Yeah. I think that's a way of doing it because you don't want to say it's a problem because then it becomes an issue. Mm. So it's very a sensitive thing. Even, you know, if you're doing the washing of your boyfriend mm. and you look at the shirts and they, you see the yellow. Yeah, the stain. Yeah, uh, then you don't have to tell them they smell. You can say, I see you sweating a lot, <laughs> you know. Here's yeah. a new product and, yeah. you know, mm. it's going to help with the staining of your shirts and it's saving us money on shirts. Yeah. So now, doctor, if you're sitting on good, you know, there's a lot of certain types of food that you can eat because of what you can eat in Zimbabwe. I think if you, I know when I go to an Indian restaurant and I eat something spicy, yeah. I sweat more. Yeah. So there is a tendency of what is in that food, but also your temperature and your body goes a little bit higher and it says, listen, let's cool down. Mm -hmm. So you sweat more, but you doesn't necessarily smell. Yes. Because you need to cool the system down. Mm -hmm. So maybe if you go out for some food that is very spicy, the problem is not the odor, the problem is you're sweating more and then you realize, mm, I maybe got an mm -hmm. odor because I was eating spicy food. Oh, okay. There is food that makes you sweat more and do give you a smell but I think that's the least of your pro uh, problems. Dr. Eddie, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. You've taught us so much about sweating and body odor, and you're just an amazing human being. <laughs> thank you for joining us. Yes, you know, this is guy. Don't only affect our health, but also how we smell. So, my son, I say, kitchen's for man, I'm trying to stop pegging down in Watermelon, papaya, peaches and grapes if desired. Munga i papaya yako followed by watermelon pieces. Faga ge i chopped pieces zako ze peach. Ufaga ge ne grapes ubao yasfuna. 
serve in a bowl and enjoy mtase. Nanimi. Now, in every season of fashion, kuba ko ezam pasha that is just a must-have. Kachonge eza sik patele zona bonba ozau ziva njani na. Nanimi. This is what we call fresh fashion, hosted by your boy Fresh by Caddy. It's too fresh, we have to say it twice. Now, we tell you what's trending in the world of fashion. And it's not only for girls, Amachita can also wear floral now. Amachita can wear my floral t shirts and shirts, floral caps, and floral socks. I want Amazon, mini cocktail floral dresses are the in thing. Namasama dresses are floral are the in thing. So you can definitely rock that in different colors. When it comes to the floral world, hashtag us on our social media pages on Facebook, Sum Nandi Me, on Twitter and Facebook, Sum Nandi underscore me. Until next time, keep it fresh, floral, and trending. Well, this is in Lena, there's something for Wonko Montu. They are also versatile and definitely not just for Amanto Mazana, but guys are rocking them too. Wear them to the office, at work, or special occasions. If you're a little shy, why not go for a subtle approach with an accessory instead? Or if we're now Zuzu Amanda, we'll head to toe shy floral because it's our favorite trend. Nanimi. Now you know what to look out for. Why don't you share your favorite scents with us on Facebook and on Twitter? See you after this. Nanimi. Nanimi. Welcome back, beautiful Mzansi. Nisakili Nati on your favorite health show, Mnandimi, right here on SAPC One. Now, Namshanja Sigma Kolange Body Odor. Sivilega Bai Body Odor can kill your self confidence, but Sapinda Safunda about the small things that you can do to kill that odor. And your understand that we answer is to freshen up your finances. Masambeke, Sui Nagula. Nanimi. The interest rates, zip prices, or if funds as they invested, okanye umtu as bolik leo e pangin. This basically means that umtu okuboleke i mali, uzo funa ukwenza i profit out of lo mali akuboleke yon. Otherwise, kuteni bezo kuboleka. The interest rate, the profit that also gives them is security. Kawa na u investa i mali as a savings ako. Guwe umtu ozo enisha in interest because ene neni, ama bandu baku save lele mali ako ngaabo ababoleke i mali abu kuwe. Hello system K7 Zamatala. So when I make sure that you stay on the right side of it, for ba wena ukwazu upilta imali zako, geo nangela elula. Nanimi. Dia temba kuba aushala nganje, but you are writing down all these financial tips as in zona because it's like neta in the long run. Owa ngogum zala ka ususi couch, ususi coffee table. Kesambe siyo chima man, it's asa lok bila. Nanimi. Are you going to get into the end of the world? Alisa is self love, Layo, Jango Ujima. Now, when that's coming up, the Selandin Patella is cream of the crop when it comes to fitness, net trainers. No, no, I'm shutting him by Ninja Yam. Upra Ernest, it is fun of this Patella today. But Ernest, welcome back. Genesis. I'm going to put him on the show. I'm going to put him on the show. I'm going to put him on the you ready? Ukala ukwezi workout yet? Oh yes. Are you sure? Yes. Today so kala nye warm up yet before we go to our workout. You you warm up yet since that you start jumping jack right? We're gonna do only up to ten and then we go to our exercise. Are you ready? Let's go. Azishi. Stop. Yay! So now, for the people like us in the gang, I think Easter jumps, so I'm jumping jacks. Who's the abbey warm enough to start with the exercise? You can just go for a minute and then you pause a little bit, maybe for 30 seconds, and then go for another minute. Okay. Then you'll be more than warm enough. Lovely. So I'm going to do exercise with you. So I'm going to push up. Okay. Also, I'm going to do the ultimate for the push ups. Yes. Okay, cool, great. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Puti, is there a specific way I'm to finger's positioning a corner for the exercise? Yes, prefer preferably your fingers must face forward mm -hmm. and then your elbows they must go in line with your body, not fly outside. Okay. So that you can feel it on your tricep and your bicep. Okay, cool. Three, 
two, one. Now we're moving from the push-up to the next exercise, which is our next exercise is a tricep. It's a tricep dips, which is this muscle that you're talking about. Are you ready to go? Are you sure? Yes. There we go. Another exercise. Ready, Emma Kayoko is joining us for the exercise. Nizo Hamon and Sister Zola, are you ready? Sister Zola, are you ready? Stand up, Malu. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, so the Mazama reps are going to be put in it. These are 12 reps. Remember, even on this exercise, yeah. your elbows should not fly to the side, but backward as you drop your waist down. Like that. The movement is only on your elbows. Yes, let's okay. go. Three, good. Four, perfect. Five. Now we're going down to our exercise. Okay. Of the crunches. That's how the exercise goes. Are you ready to start? Yeah, bro. Make sure you touch the ottoman when you come up. Five, four, three, two. Ready? Yeah, bro. Yeah, let's go. Up. The aim of coming up is to is to to crunch your abdomen. So you need to take a breath in when you come up and breath out when you're going down, so that you can feel it when you turn up. Three, two, one. Perfect. Now you can. Okay, okay, boost love. Thank you so much. But Alice, is that it for the day? That's all for today. How, 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 see how my brother, how, 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 Thank you so much. And um, nan was ba. And say kai wa wasu tatelanje. If any chanya ana ushay exercises ni ni bolam chanje. So we say ingalo zetu as well as e abdomen yetu. Brother, ye bom. Hi gang, Alicia nom shuzo man nai pela up and kubo yeti nam chanje. But thank you so much guys for joining us. Itala ni chale kini tumana nati on all our social media platforms: Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. Tuana. I'm not a body out of on Shire. It's in your sham. I'll see you next week. Mwah! Nani me. City Bale with a wonderful mental health expert of Osbonis are the way forward when it comes to mental health. We also go all out to kitchen as we try out a new recipe and all kinds of fun and more and more. Sipile Gabetuna singing a pie genie with a few new moves. My needs to go back to Nabandu Apem Zanzi, I was struggling with the bad thoughts and self esteem. My casivic, a goony band was in Zanzi. Nanny me.